In this exercise, you'll use watershed data to create non-destructive AutoCAD objects from the surface. So let's get started. This exercise uses the surface-5b drawing with the modifications you made in the previous exercise. But in this drawing, what we need to do first is we need to bring back our watersheds. So go ahead and right click on your surface, click surface properties, then choose analysis. Bring up the analysis type, which is watersheds. Click on the downward arrow to run the analysis and click OK. So when we go to select our watershed, you'll notice that it's still tied to the surface object. But what we want to do is we want to extract that information from our tin surface object. First, we need to select our surface, which brings up our contextual menu. And then if you look under surface tools, there's an extract from surface button. Go ahead and click that drop down and click on extract objects. Now in the extract objects from surface dialog box, we want to uncheck everything except for watersheds. Go ahead and click OK. And go ahead and escape from the command to deselect your surface. Now what you'll see is that if we click on our watershed, now it's created AutoCAD objects from each of the watersheds within the drawing. So that's how you go about extracting objects from a surface in Civil 3D. If you'd like to learn more about Civil 3D workflow tips and tricks, visit AutoCADCivil3Dtraining.com and be sure to sign up for future video notifications or click subscribe on our YouTube channel. Again, my name is Charles Ellison. Take care.